what's going on guys so today I'm gonna to be doing a review of Marvel's Ghost Rider and as you can see this comes with the figure as well as the motorcycle with the flame effect so I think it looks pretty cool I don't plan on doing a whole lot of unboxings on my channel but if this is something you're interested in seeing then I'll definitely do so so taking a look at the packaging here you can obviously see everything that's included. You got Ghost Rider with this chain with the flame effects on it. Uh, the motorcycle with the flame effects. I believe this is the same motorcycle that comes with the Wolverine figure. Um, with the exception of the paint job is probably a little bit different obviously. And then the, the wheels have the fire effects and then you have the flame effects there. And also there's a plate on the front of it. But we'll be able to see that once we get it all out. So... This is the front of the box, now let's take a look at the back of the box. Okay, so here we have the back of the box and it says, Johnny Blaze fires up his iconic motorcycle and hits the pavement as the streetwise hothead Ghost Rider. And Ghost Rider has been one of those characters that I've always kind of liked, I always thought his story was pretty cool. The movies that they've done on him, eh. You know, I'd, I still don't think that they actually nailed it in the movie. I thought on Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D., the Ghost Rider character they did was pretty pretty cool. He obviously wasn't on a motorcycle, he drove a car. Um, so it was a different take, but let me know in the comments what you guys think. If you're interested in seeing Ghost Rider on the big screen again. Alright, so let's get to it and get him out of the box and take a look at what we have here. Okay, so just something to note when you do get the motorcycle out of the packaging, the handlebars are not attached, so you will have to attach those, but it's pretty simple. There's a little slot right here in this area, and you just want to plug these in there. Okay, so I went ahead and took the front piece off. This is another piece that just kind of plugs in. Uh, the flame effects are all detachable. You can just pull these off and there are little tabs that hold them on. So I'm going to pull each one of those off. And then go ahead and we'll take our handlebars here and then just simply plug them in. There we go. Alright, cool. So now we have this. This is what it looks like without the flame effects on the front. The rear ones come off as well. This uh, has a kickstand, but it also has this right here where there's two stands, which makes it a lot easier when you want to balance it. All right, so for the flame effect, there's a tab right here that you may or may not be able to see. I'm not really sure. It's kind of hard um, to see it because it's all blending together, but there's a tab here that plugs into the exhaust port on the exhaust, and then there's a little tab there on the rear fender that plugs into this hole right here. And then finally, there's a third attachment point right here. These pieces just kind of clip on to the motorcycle. But we're gonna plug this piece in here. So you have this piece here that goes over the headlight. These two pieces here go on the fork. And now you have a menacing looking motorcycle that you don't want to see come riding towards you. But we're gonna make it even more menacing by adding these flame effects back on. Okay, and once it's attached, you can turn it with the handlebars. Flame effects still stay on. Okay, so there we have Ghost Rider out of the packaging. And he looks awesome just standing beside the bike. Let's go ahead and put him on the bike and see how he looks sitting on it. All right, so there we have Ghost Rider on his bike. Looking good, I like it. Out of the three figures that uh, come with motorcycles, I think Ghost Rider is probably the best, my favorite by far, actually. And I'll go ahead and throw Wolverine and Black Widow in here so you can see. All right, so here's all three of the figures that come with bikes. Like I said, I did use a different version of Black Widow um, the way I have it posed, so this isn't the version of Black Widow that comes with the bike. I do have her somewhere else in my collection, and I put Old Man Logan up here instead of uh, the figure that comes with it, which is Patch. And as you can see, the motorcycles are essentially the same. 
it's a little bit hard to tell because the Ghost Rider one is painted differently. The Wolverine version has the little saddlebags on the side, uh, but they are the same model, just painted differently. And Ghost Rider has uh, the flame attachments. So overall, I'm thoroughly impressed with the Ghost Rider figure. I think it looks awesome. So anyways, thank you guys for watching. Thank you for your support. Be sure to like and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram and look forward to more videos. See you next time.